Hi, I'm Molly. And I'm Jamie, and this is our From the Pasture with Hired Hand podcast. As the owners of Hired Hand website software, we've been developing websites and creating internet marketing strategies for livestock breeders for the past 10 years. The majority of our customers are involved in the breeding of registered animals, such as Texas longhorn, highland cattle, horses, and white-tailed deer, where the pedigrees are very important. The From the Pasture with Hired Hand podcast examines many of the differences in raising pedigreed livestock for maximum profit. Join us and learn what we're covering today. Hi, I'm Molly. And I'm Jamie. It's Monday, July 17th. And in today's mini pod, we're going to cover the top stories from the sale this last weekend, the biggest little longhorn sale in Reno, Nevada. Let's jump right into the data from this past weekend's registered Texas Longhorn Sale. If you follow our social media, then you saw that the number one most viewed animal on Hired Hand Live before the sale was Lot 26, B.L. Agnes, consigned by M7 Longhorns. She had over 245 unique views the Thursday before the sale, inching out the second most viewed animal, Lot 37, an embryo lot, consigned by Showtime Cattle Company, by a little over 100 views. Are you curious how many views at BL Agnes, the most viewed consignment, ended up with by the time the sale was over? The answer is 504 views, which is a spike of about 250 views before and during the sale time. That's pretty impressive. It sure is. But how does that relate to the best-selling animals of the sale? Glad you asked, Jamie. The high seller of the 2023 Biggest Little Longhorn Sale was also our most viewed animal, BL Agnes. Let's move on to the second most viewed animal prior to the sale. It was lot 37, an embryo lot consigned by Showtime Cattle Company with 132 views. Who was the second high seller of the sale, Jamie? The second high seller of the sale was lot one, M7 Monica's Lady. She sold for $6,750 to seller Land and Longhorns. Let's finish out the top five viewed animals and compare to how they did uh, in terms of the high selling lots. So our third most viewed animal online was lot number one, M7 Monica's Lady, with 127 views. Who was the third high seller for the sale, Jamie? The third high seller was lot 18, WH Sweet Overwhelmed Wow, who sold for 4,500 to Michaela Watts. The fourth most viewed animal on Hired Hand Live prior to the sale was lot number 17, Henry's Little Steer 609, consigned by Flying O Ranches with 119 unique views. And the high selling lot in fourth place is lot nine, HRT Gold School, sold for 3,000 to Caballo Bravo Ranch. And rounding out the top five most viewed animals was lot number 24, H.L. Baron Big Shot, consigned by Roughshod Ranch, and he came in with 108 views. And the fifth top seller in the sale last weekend was lot 14, Shadley LV, for $3,000 to Greg Cap, and he was all the way over in Virginia. He purchased the animal online. Nice. So one of the most viewed animals was also in the top five sellers then, if I heard that right. Yep, that's right. Lot number so, 26. So the bigger question I think is, did Melissa Beers get any of these top five animals right in the podcast you recorded with her last week? I don't know. They'll have to listen to find out. Let's examine a few of the trends from the post-sale data we gathered. 39 out of 42 lots sold for an unofficial total of 64,850, with an unofficial average of 1,767. There was only one scratch and two POs. The average of the top 10 lots sold was $4,200. The average of the top 25 lots sold was $2,300. With this being the 15th sale of 2023 to be included in our Hired Hired Hand Live Trends and Averages series, the 2023 annual average to date is $6,784. That's not too shabby at all. It's not. Are you curious how internet bidding affected these sale results? We hope so because that's what we're about to cover next in this mini pod episode. 
There were 41 registered internet bidders who placed 53 online bids during the sale and 15 lots sold online. To a total of eight online buyers for an internet only average of $2,203, which was $451 higher than the overall sale average. As we mentioned previously, the highest selling online lot was lot 26 BL Agnes consigned by M7 Longhorns, who sold to Austin Rohr of Rolling Horns Ranch for 17,000. And that wraps up all the stats we're sharing in today's episode. Thanks for joining us on this beautiful Monday. Be sure to check out all of our other regular podcast episodes on Spotify, Apple, and wherever you get your podcast fix. Our next post-sale mini episode will air on Monday, August 7th, and we'll cover the Great Northern Longhorn Sale in Wisconsin. To view those consignments and contribute to our most viewed online animals, visit www.hiredhandlivebidding.com. And as always, if you have an episode idea you'd like us to cover, email us at info at hiredhandsoftware.com. We'd love to hear from you.